Okay, so we're still just working with half an oven here. And I'm reaching the maximum capacity for half an oven, which is really nine of these pies with a little space in between. But I've got more pies coming. So I'm gonna go ahead and mirror what I was doing on this side on the other side. Now you gotta, you gotta keep track of stuff and make sure you're not burning anything. Because things are gonna be moving fast. The finishing zone here next to this radiant flame moves really fast. So you do your spin. Now I'm going in next to this flame. And I'm gonna bump it up. I'm gonna bump it up because I see a line of pizzas coming at me. And as quickly as I move to that other side, I'm starting to move some pies out of this side. Every time I take a pizza out of that finishing zone, I'm moving that next row in. You always want to have pizzas sitting right next to the flame. Whether you have two pizzas in there or 18 pizzas in your oven, you're always going to have some next to the flame finishing off. Just keep crowding them in. Now I can hit that third, that row. Now I'm bumping up to a second row on the second side of the oven. So I'm gonna take that flame up a little higher. So it's affecting those pizzas in the next row. These pies are just gonna keep coming. So I need to keep moving them along. As soon as these are done, I'm moving that one up there. You got an empty space, move in. Again, working both sides of the oven here. Loading in the middle, pretty much. And then marching them toward those flames. You can use this utility peel like a scalpel and get right back in there and grab whichever pie you want. Sometimes it is easier to bring it on out, give it a spin out here. Place it back in. Or spin them right in place if you can. So these are moving fast. It keeps the peel moving fast. But we are producing pies at a rate of roughly four to five pies a minute right now. Four pies a minute. If you're doing four, four minute pies, you're up in the 240, 250 pie an hour range. That's huge production. You do the math, that's gonna keep a couple of cash registers very busy. Now these pies are roughly all the same as far as one or two toppings. 
Uh, there, there's none of these that really required different conditions because these are all, you know, fairly, fairly uniform pies. Hey, every now and then you make a mistake, you dig a peel into one, cut your losses, don't try and save it, it's only gonna mess you up. Refire that pie. So now I actually have gotten down to the point where I don't have enough pies to keep this oven full anymore. So I'm gonna back it off now. I'll go ahead and just use the right side now. I'm gonna back off this left side because these three pies are done. And we'll just finish up loading in on the right side. This is a critical time when your business goes down to where you don't need 16, 18 pies in the oven you need to back it off. It also gives you a good chance to clean that side of the oven. Now every now and then, you get a pie that's got a little more on it than the rest of them. This one you don't want to move up front too fast because that's going to look done before it's even up to temperature in the middle. So we're going to make sure that's sliding and I'm going to, I'm going to leave that one back. I'm going to leave that one back for a couple extra minutes before it goes into the rotation. All right, so now business is, is dwindling back down. The number of pies I need in the oven is, is minimal, so I've gone back to just one side flame. I'm working with the right side now. As long as I'm working right next to the flame, I can have it down around three. Again, flame, flame tips just, some of them just licking the top of the flame guard. If you do get a second, a second row building, you can bump that flame just a little bit. Again, you're the one that controls the flame. So this nice, nice big fat loaded pie here, it's been sitting in the middle long enough that it's gotten some good spring to it. I can tell that it's, it's, you know, it's had its couple of minutes to, to, to start to rise. So I'm gonna move it into the rotation now and finish it with the rest of them. But that pie, is truly taking a couple more minutes. I'm giving it a couple more minutes than the one and two topping pizzas. 